are ready, Zach? <clears throat> College. It is really expensive. Paying for expensive things can be stressful for some people. It's like watching your hard-earned money go down the drain. But it's not really going down the drain, though, is it? If you said no, then you're correct. <laughs> Because that money is being used to pay for the expensive things that you hypothetically just bought. Let's say you just paid for college tuition. The average college tuition is around 30 grand per year. Now I know what you're thinking. Wow, that's a lot of money. Well, it is. It is a lot of money. <laughs> but you won't pay for the whole thing yourself. Oh no, no. You're going to have the bank giving you loans, maybe your parents will help, and your scholarships. Uh, but say that only covers like 10 grand. Then you're stuck with 20,000 all to yourself. And you could get loans to help with that, but that's still going to be paying a lot of money over time. Is it worth it? Is a higher education worth spending thousands of dollars on? I think college should be free. That way kids and parents don't end up poor as dirt by the time they're graduated. <clears throat> there are a lot of expensive schools out there, but at the same time there are a lot of cheap ones. The price for Yale is uh, close to $60,000. The price for Sarah Lawrence is $60,000. <laughs> and the University of Chicago is five hundred under $60,000. It's 50 under. Okay, 500? Like that. Alright. Um, Alright, just soak that in. Mm, yeah, it feels good. Wrong. <laughs> that is a lot of money. Actually, a majority of undergraduates at Yale borrow money just to pay for college. Nearly 20 million Americans attend college each year, and of those 20 million, close to 12 million borrow annually to cover costs. And get this. Student loan debt is close to one dollar, uh, one trillion dollars. <laughs> if you don't see a problem with that, then I know this great eye doctor. I'll give you the number out. Thanks. Um, <laughs> a lot of debt is past due, which means people aren't paying the bills on time. Why do you think that? Oh, I don't know. Maybe college is too expensive. Uh, so, automatically, high people can't make enough money to... I, I wrote this wrong, so... Did you say high people can't make enough money? <laughs> um, so, meanwhile in Europe, over in the east, across the Atlantic, lies our friends in Europe. They, for some odd reason, don't have to pay for college. Oh, by the way... Macon State College, 340 per year, and uh, South Texas, 5600 per year, pretty cheap. Now in Europe, Austria, they don't have to pay tuitions. Czech Republic, if you speak Czech, you don't have to pay for tuition. Denmark, you don't have to pay for tuition. Greece, you don't have to pay. In Iceland, there is a user's fee, or a registration fee, but you don't have to pay for tuition. In Iceland, Ireland. Pay for tuition. That's Ireland, bro. That's Ireland? Oh, you already know what Iceland is about. Yeah, my bad. I'm no, my bad. I'm no. sorry, I interrupted your speech. Oh, there are other schools, like France and Spain, that they do have to pay a small tuition fee, but it's still, it's small. Um, yeah. Now granted, their taxes are higher, but so far it seems to be working for them, as far as I can tell. Uh, another note to taking, another thing to note is that because their college is so cheap, they can take a year off and not have to worry about it. They can travel the world, see new things, experience greater experiences, and then use that time to figure out what they really want to do in the world, and then go to college, free of charge. <clears throat> now, in 
2011 Forbes magazine, it reported that around 71% of Americans hated their job. I think that because we're forced to go to college right after school, because it's such a financial issue, that a lot of us don't have time to actually figure out what we want to do. Now, I could be wrong. There could be other reasons. That's just my, that's just my standpoint. If you were to ask me what I would do about a situation like this, why don't we take a chapter out of our neighbor's book and make college free? about what we wanted to do in life. We wouldn't be buried in mountains of debt. We wouldn't be laying, living out of our parents' basements. And uh, we wouldn't be digging into our retirement funds. No more rising tuition prices. No more. Some universities have taken students to court for overdue loans. That's just absurd. There will be no more of that, either if college is free. Uh, there will be no more of that as well. Um, on the flip side, college of uh, free college taxes would be higher, probably uh, way higher than what we were expecting. <laughs> but that is a price we are willing to pay. Um, in short, <laughs> we shouldn't have to pay for a higher education. It should be a privilege to learn more. A cheap, inexpensive privilege. No more debt. No more student loans. No more other bad things about college that have to do with money and not enough of it. If we were to fix this situation, we would be happy. Lovely. Rich too damn high.